Assalamualaikum to our expected Dr. Isa. We are from group 1, we'll pick Sephora for our video assignment too. So, here are the list of members for the group 1. Nurul Hanani, Sharina, Nadia Natasha, Nur Shazwani, and Nurul Hafiza. Here are the table of content for the video. And it will start with the nature of business, and follow with the qualitative technique, a short brief, and the technique that used for Sephora, which is expert, healthy, and NG detecting. And last but not least, we will end it, the video with the benefits of the techniques that been used for Sephora. Nature of business Sephora. A leader in prestige omni retail, their mission at Sephora is to create a welcoming beauty shopping experience for all and inspire fearless in our community. Owned by LVMH Moet Hennessy Lewis Burton, the world leading luxury good groups Sephora was founded in France by Dominique Mendonen in 1970. They operate over 2,700 2, stores in 35 countries worldwide with an expanding base of over 500 stores across the Americas and a world-class e-commerce site. Since opening our first US store in New York, Soho neighborhood in 1998, Sephora has been an industry-leading champion of diversity, inclusivity, and empowerment in the US, guided by their long-standing company values. There are three qualitative techniques, that is uh, expert forecast, Delphi technique, and also nominal group technique. For the first technique is expert technique. Uh, expert techniques is to guide its product offerings and strategic decision. In the Sephora, the company collaborates with a beauty expert, makeup artist, dermatologist, and influencer to gain insight into the evolving demands and needs of consumers. Also, they consider factors such as color palette, ingredient preference, and innovative formulation to determine which trends are likely to gain traction among consumers. And uh, the Sephora constantly monitors uh, emerging technologies and collaborate with the beauty tech uh, technology expert to predict how innovation will shape the industry. This includes investment in AR and AI technology which have uh, revolutioned the way customers interact with beauty products. In addition, Delphi Technique also used in the Sephora. This technique involves a series of questionnaires or survey. Uh, before launching a new product, uh, Sephora seeks the uh, opinions of experts regarding formulation, packaging, and market viability. Uh, this is allows Sephora to refine its product based on the insight gathered through multiple rounds of questionnaires. For the point number two is the market research. Market research is another area where Sephora utilizes the Delphi technique. When exploring new markets or considering strategic initiative, Sephora consults a panel of experts to assess market potential, competitive landscape, and consumer behavior. These experts may include market analysts, industry consultants, and business targets. This information helps Sephora make informed decisions regarding market entry, expansions, and diversification. For the third technique we choose is nominal group techniques. The definition of nominal group techniques is this technique is a group decision making method that Sephora has employed to gather insights and ideas from a diverse group of participants. The first point is one of the key application of the nominal group techniques at Sephora is in generating new product ideas. Sephora organized brainstorming session or workshop where participants from different departments such as marketing, research and development, and customer service come together to contribute their ideas. During this session, participants individually generate ideas related to a specific product category or theme. These ideas are then shared and discussed openly within the group. 
This process allows for equal participation and ensure that all perspectives are considered. For the point number two is NGT has been instrumental in process improvement within Sephora. The technique is used to identify and prioritize area for enhancement, such as customer service procedure, inventory management, or employee training programs. Sephora involves relevant stakeholders, including frontline employees, managers, and quality assurance personnel in NGT session to gather their input and suggestions. The group collectively discuss and rank the purpose improvement, ensuring that all that the solution align with the company's goals and meet the needs of both employees and customers. So let's move to the benefits of expert forecast to Sephora. First of all, it will improve inventory management. It is because by better predict demand for its product, it's allowing Sephora to optimize the inventory levels and reduce the risk of obsolescence. Next, it will be better workforce planning. It also can help Sephora plan its workforce more effectively by ensuring that it has the right numbers of employees with the right skills to meet demand. Alright, now let's move to the benefits of Delphi Technique to Sephora. First and foremost, it will improve forecasting accuracy. The Delphi technique can help Sephora improve the accuracy of its forecast by incorporating experts' insights and opinions. The second one, it will be reduced bias. Why it will re reduce the bias? Uh, because it's allowing experts to provide input anonymously, reducing the influence of dominant personalities or group things. The third benefit of Delphi Technique is Sephora can gain insight into emerging trends, potential challenges, and new opportunities. The last one is, by identifying potential risks and challenges, it allows Sephora to take proactive measures to mitigate those risks and protect their business. Lastly, we will move to the benefit of nominal group technique, or known as NGT. By using the NGT, Sephora can generate a wide range of ideas and perspectives on topics related to their business such as product development, marketing campaigns, and customer service. Additionally, NGT can help Sephora engage with their stakeholders and foster a sense of community and collaboration which can lead to increased customer loyalty and employee satisfaction. So, that's all for our presentation. Thank you for listening.